to Raising Rayburns, and today we have a grocery slash Dollar Tree haul for you, and there are a lot of items, so let's get started. I am not kidding when I say that there are a lot of items today. It takes up the entire island. We are starting with Dollar Tree items. I picked up three cans of the white chicken. I'm going to be doing a chicken casserole recipe with mostly Dollar Tree products, so that's why I bought those. A can of Rotel and a can of cream of chicken soup. Thomas needed some toothbrushes to use for cleaning purposes at work, so we picked the six pack that comes in a box so he can store them as well. Some men's three in one Ocean Surge. I needed some more shampoo and conditioner and they had the large one. This is their Salon Selective and I never noticed this but this is both paraben and sulfate free now. Yay. Dollar Tree we went to had some mystery squishies so I got two of those, one for each kiddo. We're going to open those and see what's inside. Two cans of Alfredo sauce and then this Dollar Tree had the actual squishies, the big ones. And they're, ooh, super fun to play with and scented. Joanna wanted a unicorn. We got some water toys for the splash park here in our neighborhood. Thomas picked up some Thomas's English muffins, blueberry. This was at Dollar Tree still, yep. Dollar Tree carries Thomas's English muffins here. And so that will be for breakfast for him for the week. We got some potato hot dog buns and a package of burrito shells and those there's a whole big pack of them. I mean, a dollar, y'all. Thomas wanted a package of Top Ramen, and I picked up some popsicles for the kiddos, some wide egg noodles for that casserole, and then some penne pasta there. I hauled this the last video, but I picked up another one of these beauty creams because that's such a great deal, and I figured I'm going to run out eventually. Some poppets and allergy pills. Thomas and I both like these ones from Dollar Tree and so we got five boxes worth or six boxes worth there. A twinkle twinkle little star pillow for Joanna. She has one already but it died and there you go. That's what she likes most about it. And some party poppers for the kids as well and some bottled water. Going into the grocery items we went to Walmart for groceries this week so there's some eggs a loaf of bread, banana and apple, applesauce for Joanna, apple strawberry applesauce for Melanie. Oh, I forgot this from Dollar Tree too. Joanna wanted a box of macaroni and cheese. We have some graham crackers, goldfish, flavor blasted for Joanna, traditional for Melanie. Down here in the front, we have sour cream and cream cheese. American singles, we just like to always keep these on hand for Joanna to have grilled cheese. Some hot dogs, lettuce, milk, breakfast for myself for the week. Jimmy Dean breakfast bowls, sausage, egg, potato, and cheese. Tomatoes, some chicken breast strips, ground beef, pork chops, puff corn. I love this stuff, y'all. It's addicting. A giant box of Coca-Cola for Thomas and myself. Some au gratin potatoes in the back. Yogurt for Joanna, same thing we get every week. A Caesar salad kit, three packs of whipped topping. I'm gonna to be making a dessert with these, which is why I have so many. Shredded cheddar cheese, it being Walmart, you know there's always some miscellany that gets purchased. Joanna needed new shoes. We had gotten shoes for her last week, they were too big, so we exchanged them while we were there. Yo Play yogurt for Melanie and myself. Giant box of waffles here in the back. Strawberries and blueberries for that dessert that I am making. Chocolate chips, bananas. A whole bunch of the turkey and American cheese Lunchables for Joanna. Some cosmic brownies because they're yummy. And then these items are also from Dollar Tree. They just did not fit on the other side. So a whole array of candy. Again, I like to keep candy on hand for those snack cravings. It's cheaper to plan ahead than it is to stop at 7-Eleven or some other convenience store. And then some wands for the girls. 
that is everything that was purchased from both Walmart and Dollar Tree. The total for this haul was $170. That does include breakfast, lunch, and dinner for seven days, as well as all of the items from Dollar Tree that were purchased, which was a lot of just miscellaneous things, and of course, the shoes. So I think that's pretty darn good. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, do not forget to give it a big thumbs up. As always, do not forget to celebrate the everyday. I am celebrating the fact that once again, we are going into the week fully prepared and we have been doing an amazing job of eating at home exclusively. And I'm very excited that that trend is spiking upwards. You know what I mean? We will see you next time. Bye.